to avoid spraying. The moment your cat walks back up to a door or other household item raises his tail and urinates on it, you know there's a problem. House cats often exhibit this behavior known as spraying. Although it is a highly bothersome issue, it can be fixed. Spraying isn't an issue with the litter box, as is often believed, rather, it's a problem with marking territory. Pheromones, which are found in sprayed cat urine, are used as a form of communication between cats and other animals. Pheromones are a kind of biometric identification used by other animals to positively identify the cat, similar to how fingerprints are used by humans. A cat's spraying behavior is nothing more than a method of territorial marking. Spraying is the cat's technique of claiming his area as his own. The frustration and anger you feel toward your cat will accomplish nothing. Spraying may increase if you become irritated with your cat or raise your voice. Urine has a strong odor that attracts cats in heat. Spraying is a form of communication between cats in heat. Cats who mark their territory when in heat usually have kittens within a few months of the mating. Keep in mind that some cats spray when they meet other cats or when they are agitated. While cats use spraying as a form of communication, the odor it leaves behind is offensive to humans. The good news is that most cats prefer to spray in the open air. Spraying might be a real issue if your cat never goes outdoors. You need to take prompt action if you discover spraying in your house. Having your cat altered, either neutered or spayed, depending on the sex, is the most efficient and least time-consuming method of preventing spraying. After being neutered, most male cats immediately stop marking their territory with spray. Think about alternatives if you don't want to have your cat altered. Not getting your cat neutered or spayed is a must if you plan on reproducing with him in the future. Consultation with your veterinarian is recommended. In addition to providing guidance, he may be able to help you avoid surgery altogether. Your vet can rule out the possibility of a medical condition being the root of the issue. For the simple reason that cat pee smells and may leave stains all over your house, you should always take action as soon as you see it.